Hi, it has been a while since I've been on this Linux Plasma just for the tutorials. That's an SSD just for a video. So I've never touched anything unless you see what I do. One of the things probably I'll need to do is update, right? It has been a while. I've been developing on Linux ISO and four Linux B ISOs. Uh, so we need to definitely get some stuff in. Yep, quite a bit. Every time you see something called Arco Linux, you have to see here they are three packages, four packages for Arco Linux. You'll see where it's going to be put, and I see already it's going to be in the ETC scale. So if you see a scale, and by the way, I'm not happy with my downloads at all, not fast enough for me, so I stop everything with Ctrl C it is. Then you do a mirror, it's our command to make sudo reflector up here you see it yes you see a command uh, started up there and then we try again update now you know that's my case when i do the old mirror i get even worse uh, numbers you see it's even worse than it used to be so the solution is get in a new patch rc because in there are four new mirrors at this point in time oh sorry and we have uh, one mirror and that's it and there's the typo to become a mirror right that's not the latest bash rc where is the latest bash rc pseudo pacman minus s arco linux uh, plasma i think no arco linux let's get the whole list out here config plasma let's get that in this will result in stuff going inside here I see a warning here we should see what that is but anyway if you see elements into etc scale we need just to scale the thing which means I have now a file manager in here with a new control H. There is a new badge or C latest in here. So these two guys, if we compare them and we don't have anything to compare, we can do this. That's good. Compare files. But is it the way I want? Yes, it's good. It's good. So this one is new bash or C. I would like to have that one to here, but it's not created with melt. This is something else. It has the logo, but it's compare. So it's another uh, program, another application that is opening that I not rather not have. So compare files is that one. And we do not have the service at this point so what i like to do is like in tunar which is installed by the way because of the fact that we love all the right mouse clicks that we have here we can just say simply compare and that's what i want to achieve but then in um, plasma i'll install it later let's first fix our mirrors so get everything in that one as well you see that in many other tutorials so i'm going to skip all the explanations here and just make sure that left and right are the same until i get this message files are identical height close and safe so now i have these mirrors in there the only thing i still need to do is tell to the system look um let's run source oh no application all right, I want to have, uh, well, I normally would type uh, the terminal, right? The termite, I mean. But since we are on um, Plasma, I think we better type console. Console, yeah, like this, I think. Ctrl Alt. Uh, here it is. Terminal is called console with a K, everything is okay. Okay, okay. So 
not right mouse click this time with thermite we are on tunar not this time because we're on plasma so a decision i just made just now okay so we need to get this bash or see things let's let's call an alias oh well, wait 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 look no matter everything is sourced already he knows already that the alias is existing the new aliases i mean for mirror are here the fours for uh, aliases anyway just to complete if it's not loaded bash rc you should source dot bash rc and that's it and then everything is in there so mirror let's do an update first nothing changed right oh so happy with this right frustrating total met yep no we don't want to get frustrated we just type mirror again but this time this is another mirror but what's behind it is a new alias this new alias might do the trick and he's asking all these servers who's the fastest out there and it seems to be this one and he's going to put the fastest one at the top in etc pacman.d mirror list that's where he's going to put it and when i type now update i just hope everything goes much faster as before and we have a problem oh yeah i've probably done a, did a ctrl z and doing a ctrl z during an, an update or anything you can get a split package right it's corrupted so yeah sure delete everything okay let's do it again then yep and off we go so that's going to be installed and updated we got our new aliases in via this one package and all the rest is following you now i had a mirror issue that's why we got the new bash rc in and then we reloaded our servers the mirror is going to look for other servers that are faster better and then orders them into the mirror list so that's done when this is done i'll need to check out if there are other things on the aor because update updates arch linux arch linux and stops pksya yua if you do it one after the other then the rest will be aor if you start with pksya yua is going to update just everything so let's just show you that everything is up to date you'll see still here 10 available updates let's see what he says about that and there we go we are off to download 10 things in c etc etc um, this might cause an issue we'll see and uh, there we go let's him install everything so we're just updating fine the tutorial <laughs> i promised to record everything so okay um the tutorial is actually about melts people are asking to me eric is it possible that we have in dolphin a possibility to compare these two guys here bash rc bash rc latest compare can be done with this element here but uh, frankly i don't get this application myself about compare i like my uh, melt application and the question is can we have that there is a possibility to make dolphin even better and one of the things you can do is get in here and go to configure dolphin go to the services and install lots of elements with seems we've installed already root so download new services installed uh -huh. everything is installed there is nothing installed yet so it was basically already installed i think since i've recorded everything but it has been a while since i was on this machine and then you need to look you never know what's going to, to work and i think the best thing is for us to join on discord and there's this um this challenge here 
is it still open so we have this plasma challenge up here plasma challenge and we can talk to each other and say okay this service works that's interesting service etc etc themes and every tip and um, clue we can give each other so i believe it was um, this one let's have a look so we have these um, stars but 50 54 and 50 i mean what to decide you can change the take a look at the details but is that working or not the only way to know is install okay now i know already because i tested that that's a good one but the other two didn't function the other two are there but they don't function so we have now a new menu and we can use compare selected files not these two but this one works and that's just enough for me to say okay one and two it opens melt fine i melt it here open out voila it opens melt and i can make my comparisons if i type something here it becomes blue so yeah it does work and that's exactly what i want to close without saving so basically it's um Dolph dolphin can be changed can be a lot of things can be added um, let me take a look if i have other services i would recommend all right um, everything is up to date let's check again so there were no issues for oh yeah being still to be done for the icons that's the very last one now everything is up to date fine so if we have a system that we can update until the last very uh, very last package services download new services one of the things i need as well is convert png to gpg for my websites right and there is one i think the question is maybe i should look like this and then you try it out there is no guarantee that this will work it's uh, similar as the uh, elements you can add in cinnamon there are some widgets and extensions and all that there is no guarantee it will work it uh, depends on the uh, cinnamon version and so on same goes here try it out i think it's this one that works so install and if we have an image you know if we took some images let's close here okay images mm, png gpg gpg png all gp yeah here's a png right mouse click convert to gpg and up oh, there we go so by xeon so that's how we add elements how we can improve dolphin by adding services so please let's share what we find what works and what doesn't work it may be also interesting to share that but i think more importantly share things that do work and there was another one i installed on my other plasma called simple root actions let's see this one is that the one i installed it's from that guy Peja km that's the one i installed what was this again you can check out what it does um, more or less if you really can see edit as root delete as root and something else as root so delete as root edit root open root run as root backup as root rename as root stuff like that uh, go to the home page you can always see more on uh, that page store.kde is more visible to read but whether it works or not depends on a lot of things but we can always give it a go give it a try and see what uh, it brings to our system what we if it improves anything if it's uh, what we want to have so root actions ownership i believe that was already there um, don't see it right now maybe we should restart not sure but i had installed it in the other system just wanted to share it um, so services if you want to get rid of it as well so installed these things have been installed yeah that's the one i installed anyway so if we uninstall it like this close 
okay uh, as you can see that's still there so it must be there after a reboot or something uh, what else there's one else other thing I installed in there not sure if it's um, something that you want but it's called make multiple scripts or binary executable so binary executable let's see so this thing is coming from Alex and dash L or I I don't know there are some details you can see make a donation scripts it says makes executable and this copy to user bin I think it says so if you install that one okay then depending on the file I guess I don't think it's gonna be in here depending on the file uh, let's uh, go to home do I have something in documents let's make something in documents create new text file test okay I better maybe make test.sh whoops not she f2 and see what happens maybe we see now something yep there's the script make executable so right mouse click properties details permissions is executable that's what it's going to do this uh, step making an executable just right mouse click script executable done let's check with properties permissions and there it is it's checked so things like that services that you miss elements that you are missing in this uh, file manager you can try and find some substitution for it in the services in the download new services and go and find more and more elements a lot of things in there loading data is getting more and more data in and just start typing searching on a name and you'll see and get even more elements in all right so that's the services for you the idea was actually to uh, show you well these services and we've done also the updates in the meantime now talking about updates I just thought of something if we did an ETC scale there is in the bin something you should run as well there is uh, if we did the scale Eric um, the scale is not present so control T scale aha there they are so running scale copies everything from the etc scale from the last update and now we have a folder and we also stuff to install samba and network discovery because as of 18.12 we will not have samba installed as such after a clean installation and um, in stay rolling we have this idea if you want to keep um, well updating like we just did and not do a clean install and you want to be have the same things as we have like on 18.12 after a clean installation you need to uninstall Samba and if you need Samba just keep it there but if you don't need it just remove everything that's that and if you want to stay rolling then you need to actually run that script as well it's going to delete a lot of stuff and replace it with the same stuff but this time in a package a long video and explanation is about uh, is, has been written about it and you can see it in arclinux.com and in arclinuxiso.com as well so there you go we have now samba uninstalled there is no samba anymore so the system status or something well it just makes no sense to ask the status of samba because i just uninstalled it it's okay it's gone and if you want to back it's simple it's in the main here use the scripts install the samba and install network discovery and we can um, work again uh, send images pictures files videos over the network at your home in your home network okay last thing which i always tend to forget is basically you can call your system now 18 point 12 
point seven. Yep, there we are. We are now at the latest release. We did not do it any clean installation whatsoever, but also this plasma system is now 18.12.7. I guess that's enough for this video. Cheers.